Now, they're young, British, and taking on Hollywood. A new generation of black actors, including John Boyega in the blockbuster Star Wars, have all been trained at the Identity School of Acting in London. Established in 2003, it now boasts a roster of talent that's doing well in America. The British Film Institute has identified a lack of diversity in filmmaking and Colleen Harris has been to meet some of the school stars who are breaking the industry's glass ceiling. They are some of the British faces breaking into Hollywood, an industry under scrutiny over its lack of diversity. I was raised to do one thing. Before hitting the big time with Star Wars, John Boyega began his career at the Identity School of Acting, then a small startup in London. Yeah? Your voice is inside of you. I went to see the school and to meet John. It's a family environment identity, but at the same time, there's, there's a discipline that kind of mirrors what it's like in the industry after being in it now. And so they, they teach you what it's like to work. How much about what you do is about breaking glass ceilings? All of it. All of it. And there's purpose in everything, I feel. So there's a value in making others see themselves in a better way and you've got to break glass ceilings to do that and that's what I'm doing. Today it's thriving and open to all, but the school opened 14 years ago as Britain's first black drama school. Its founder Femi Ogans also set up an agency with it to address the lack of diversity. For me, rather than join the chorus of complaint, I, I decided, you know what, we need to do something about this. And this is something that we nurtured and developed in the school. We developed this whole sense of worth. You had to celebrate your sense of purpose and you had to realise that you are the architect of your own fortune. Another identity graduate, Letitia Wright, will soon appear in cinemas in the new Marvel Black Panther film. She says the school instills a sense of confidence and self-belief. We went into audition rooms, not looking at the color of our skin, but looking at our talent. And like, I remember when I went for Hobie City, I was the only black girl in the room, but I never felt inferior. I felt I have something to offer. And the role turned from a Caucasian girl to a black girl because our agents f like made that fight to say, why not? and that breaks, that breaks chains. That attitude helped launch Malachi Kirby, another former student. His portrayal of Kunta Kinte in the Roots remake has been highly praised by critics. My way of fighting is through my art, um, by not accepting that there are roles that aren't for me or won't be given to me. And like, there are stories that I want to tell and there are stories that I believe I know how to tell and they don't just, they're not just defined by what I look like. Capitalising on its talent, 60% of Identity's clients are now working and based in the States. But here, the work continues and John Boyega is being honoured for his success. It hasn't been easy and we, we fought for this um, and now we're here. And, and we're ready to expand through the drama school, through other means, expand the opportunity to others. And that's what identity is about. A movement that's nurturing the next Hollywood success. Colleen Harris, BBC News.